Oh my God, a big buck was right there. He just slipped over the side of the hill. Oh, damn it. Day six of the hunt, Thursday the 15th, I believe. I'm just getting out really late in the afternoon for one hunt today. I was, I was busy all morning through the lunch hour, putting the video up on my channel of the day five hunt recap. I'm gonna walk in here, um, check my one trail cam that I have out and put a second one back out. Okay, let's see what we've got. Those 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 do 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 a do and another do no bucks i freshened up the corn patch cuz all of the corn was gone reset my camera and i'm going to continue on up the draw here I've got another trail that's higher up. I want to put a camera on. Heavily traveled. The sign on this trail is really fresh. You can see it right there. Oh yeah, look at this. All fresh dirt moved. Look at those tracks. Two years ago, that would have been me down there in the city, running code to some call. Instead, I'm up on the mountainside, setting out scent strips, which I have to tell you is a much better job than law enforcement. I did that for 36 years. I'm so happy be out of it there hopefully that should catch some passing bucks attention make him stop and take a sniff and if not I put a few drops on this log right here okay now I'll sweeten it up with a little corn for the does and then I'll set the camera up and get out of here Oh my god, a big buck was right there. He just slipped over the side of the hill. Oh, damn it. He's one of those from the trail cam for sure. I think he's a three point. Son of a gun, he was right by that big tree there. He saw me though, so he dipped over into the draw. There he is right there, looking right at me. Oh no, that's another one, that's a spike. He's not legal. You see him right there? Right off the tip of my arrow. I recognize him from my trail cam. That's that big spike. Oh man, finally, finally, I run into these guys. Big 
guy go? Here comes a spike. Oh man. It's like a 30 yard shot. But it has to be two point or better. He was just like a ghost. I happened to look over to my left and he was paralleling me silently. Yeah, he was the big three point. They must have been running together. Oh, it's all a matter of luck and fate. Just substitute the three point for the spike and I would have had a shot back there. 130 yards. See, even if he was legal, I wouldn't shoot him. That's why I don't shoot spikes. 32 yards. They're just not developed enough yet. You know, they don't have their wits about them. And it's not really a fair contest. Case in point, that big three-point, <laughs> he knew what he was doing. The minute he knew that I had eyes on him, he just kind of ghosted over the horizon. I think my theory is correct though. I think they're not here during the day. I think they're up there on the mountaintop. I really do. Look at that. Could you kill that deer? Yeah. Next year, yeah, he'll be a nice two point. He's got a nice set of little spikes on him. Hold on, buddy, I'm gonna range you again. Eighteen point five yards. <laughs> oh gosh. Look at him, he's like a little pet. Hey bud, you gotta get some smarts. You gotta get some smarts about you. He runs off, stops again at 30, and he's gonna walk right up the hill and stand broadside. I saw something, and that's great. That made my day. Actually, it's made my week. Best part of this entire week since opening day has been uh, seeing the bucks on my trail cams, and then right now, running into the bucks as they're coming down off the mountain there. That's been very encouraging.